Hello artists! Today we're going to take a look at a very famous artist named Vincent van Gogh. Vincent van Gogh was a Dutch artist who lived in France during the 1800s, which was a really long time ago. But his artwork is still very well known. You might recognize some of his work, like Starry Night, Sunflowers, and his many self-portraits. Ah, yeah. I did many self-portraits. Oh, hi, Vincent. What are you doing here? Hi, Miss Brandenberger. Guten Tag, class. I was hearing you talk about my work and wanted to come explain how I do what I do. Yes, I would love to hear all about how you made your paintings. Oh, of course. So, I learned a lot from my Impressionist friends in France, like Claude Monet. He did the water lily painting. And Paul Gauguin. He liked to paint people and beautiful tropical landscapes. I noticed that you said you learned from your Impressionist friends. Mm -hmm. What's an Impressionist, Vincent? Impressionism is a style of painting. We don't focus on making things look uh, realistic. We rather paint the feeling or the mood of the scene. Let's look at one of my most famous paintings, Starry Night. Notice how you can see the brush strokes? The impressionists like to see the paint on the canvas. We don't blend the paint together so much. We also like to show many colors at once. Look at the sky in my painting. How many different colors can you see? Wow, you used a lot of colors. My favorite part is the moon and stars. They really look like they're glowing. Yeah, the brushstrokes I use really help the painting look alive, almost like it's moving. <laughs> oh, well, Vincent, I feel really inspired now. Oh. I kind of want to do my own Impressionist painting. Do you have any tips for me? Oh, yeah. So, when you are picking a scene, pick something with very good lighting, yeah, some uh, good shadows, and remember to use lots of colors, okay? It doesn't have to look realistic. It's about capturing the beauty of the colors and mood of the moment. Well, great. I can't wait to get started. Ah, okay. Have fun. I'm going to paint a picture of the flowers in my garden. There's a lot of light and shadow, and the colors are really vibrant. If you don't have paint at home, you can still use this technique with other materials, like markers, crayons, or paper. Experiment with the materials that you have at home. Well, here's my Impressionist painting. I'll call it Marigolds Dancing in the Sunlight. Wow, Miss Brandenberger. You know, for your first Impressionist painting, I have to say I'm very impressed. <laughs> Vincent, thank you so much for teaching me to paint like an Impressionist. And I hope you guys try this at home too. Don't forget to send us your pictures. See you next time. Bye-bye. Excellent! <laughs> <laughs>
next line. <laughs> you want to start with a scene that is very nice in color? No, not that. Okay. Let's stop this. How do you do this? Goodbye, class.